Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, go ahead, Safa. <laughs> well, I was just going to say, we're, uh, this is the uh, closing remarks section where we get to, again, thank people and get people to share their lessons learned and whatnot. But uh, Leo, since you've, you've stayed up to uh, to say something, let's, let's, let's turn it over to you. Oh, oh, what should I be saying? I, I mean, I'm, uh, I let know. me just turn on the webcam first. <laughs> And uh, as you can see, the day has progressed. I'm not blasting light into my face. I'm now sitting instead of, you know, standing. So you can tell that it's getting quite late for Europe right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm not sure if you want me to, to go. We've already done a little bit of our closing remarks anyway before uh, Corwin's talk. So yeah. yeah, what do you want me to add? I mean, you've all, we've all been thanking one another. We've been thanking the speakers. Uh, you know, nothing would have been possible without the efforts of, you know, all the other organizers in the team, but also the speakers. So I'll just reiterate what Corwin has been telling you. Thank you so much for being so mu so many today. I believe we've tripled the amount of viewers that we had for the previous Emax Conf, and that's mind boggling to have so many people have seen me to, to think that so many people have seen me spill water on myself and do a fool of myself for the entire day. It is <laughs> outstandingly stupid, but still, thank you so you much. Know. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's fun. Go on, so Sasha. This, yeah, this is, this is going, going really, really well. Um, but of course, there's, there's always ideas we can, we can try to make it even, even better. So if you have any ideas or if you have any uh, comments on the things that work really well that you'd like us to keep doing tomorrow, Please make sure to leave them in the Etherpad. Uh, so the URL is somewhere in all the different places we put it. And there's a section all the way at the end where you, people can drop in their general feedback, uh, what went well, what can be improved. If you want to volunteer to help out with copying questions, for example, that might be great. Uh, anyways, it's, it's all there. Uh, and um, that's that's my part. Cool. Yeah, yeah. It's really um... <laughs> Sorry, so I'll say that again. Uh, it's been lots of fun. And there's tomorrow. Oh my goodness. There's still tomorrow. <laughs> oh, there's oh, tomorrow. God, Damn yeah. it. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's been a lot of fun today. Um, let's see. So, yeah, um, I guess we did go through the stats before, but I'll also quick, uh, quickly add that, um, you know, I've been looking a bit of an eye on the server's network bandwidth usage and you know today we've had about 1.3 terabytes of outbound traffic um which is definitely something and um, it's a record it's by by far you know shattered last year's numbers we had i think about like 400 viewers live um peaking at one point um and it's very humble humbling to see um like so many people um you know tune in to watch talks um about their favorite piece of software um about emacs and um you know be part of the community and you know have us be be part of the community or i guess um you know run this sort of an event so it's been absolutely awesome um i guess i can quickly get to the thanks if you leo or sasha don't have anything else to add nope all good all righty um yeah so let's see uh, i'd like to thank the free software foundation especially the tech team um for for their general support for letting us use their big blue button um yeah thank you so much it, it's it's made a lot of difference this year um you know last year for emacs conf 2019 we used um jitsi meet um <laughs> which was awesome but um you know, it, we, we did run into some technical difficulties with it, but this time, um, you know, Big Blue Button was for the most part smooth sailing. Um, so yeah, thank you very much to the Free Software Foundation, Foundation for letting us use their Big Blue Button instance. Uh, allow me to just interject for a second. It was smooth sa sailing for absolutely every single speaker but myself. Well, I managed to have three different problems with Big Blue Button, so I'll be fighting bug reports all night. You can be sure of that. <laughs> Please do. Um, yeah, that's that's the beauty of free software, I guess, is, you know, it, it can be frustrating, but at least, you know, there's multiple ways forward with, you know, reporting bugs and sending patches. Um, and, you know, that's part of, I guess, the message that um, I'm hoping 
that like you know people would take away from an event like this um around a community like this um you know emacs you know being a, such an um long-standing piece of free software um and having this large of a community around it who who's been continuing to grow um and mature with emacs and you know every year we get new people in um more and more people discover e emacs um you know join the community or communities i should say um it's just wonderful and a large part of it is possible because emacs is free software um so that's yeah, that i mean at the risk of spoiling my own talk uh-huh I I, I want to say that's that's what we're going to pivot to tomorrow. That's that's what uh, Welcome to the Dungeon talk is really about, why it has to be free software. And as you peel the project apart, uh, right. I think you'll see something Eric and I have for a long time that it is shameful to even think about trying to put some things outside of the public domain. Right. Yeah. It Exactly, and, and and I think that's a good, good point to bring this up. Um, this is a closing remark, um, but it's only for today. You know, we've got tomorrow, a long day of events, um, much like today. Um, you know, I say it long, but in a way, like thinking back, it kind of like went by like this. So, um, yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun, um, much like today was. Um, so yeah, definitely tune in tomorrow. Um, we're going to be starting at the same time, same place, you know, live.emaxconf.org um, for the specific mount points. For example, you know, we'll be using main.webm and main-480p.webm. Um, I want to say a thank you to Sasha for setting that up um, and getting it running because I remember last year, <laughs> um, you know, we had a couple of people um, requesting that, you know, a a lower resolution um, stream or mount point be made available um, because of their limited bandwidth. And it, it, like when, when you have like free software tools, it's not too hard um, to get something like that going. Um, I, I mean, not impossible, I should say. It wasn't too easy. Uh, we did have some technical difficulties yeah, with it today. Um, I'm learning more about FFmpeg than I expected to know at this point, but it's great. <laughs> Maybe right. it'll work tomorrow too. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. Sasha can attest to it. Um, it. You know, there were still some kinks spitting iron out, um, and it's a process. But you know, we're all learning. Um, each, each of us in our own ways. Um, yeah. So there's that. I'm very happy to have had that mount point to make Emacs Conf accessible to people in. Um, you know, areas of the world where bandwidth may not be, um, you know, as cheap or as readily available, um, or just, you know, someone wanting to watch on their phone, um, even here, um, you know, in the US and Canada, data plans are not exactly cheap or unlimited. So, um, yeah, that's great. Let's see. Yeah, so we are already halfway yeah. through this month's uh, network bandwidth usage for our server um, for tomorrow. Okay. We should save some for tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, All right. Yeah, but for, for tomorrow, I'll probably try bumping up the server a little bit more to get us some bandwidth, some more bandwidth. Um, yeah, um, in, in terms of thank yous, um, can you scroll down a little bit, please? Of course. Uh, thank you. Right. Um, yeah, so the FSF and FSF tech team again for letting us use their pixel button instance, um, uh, volunteers and organizers. Um, so there's, there's me, um, there's Bavin192, there's David Bremner, David O'Toole, um, uh, Corwin, who both presented and also has been helping out. Um, and especially, um, Oops, can you scroll up again in the pad? Leo, Leo. <laughs> um, right. So sorry, I got distracted by cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we'll all be able to sorry, go ahead. Okay, go no no, go ahead. I was just being distracted. <laughs> um yeah, we'll have some time to check it out later after the event today. Um 
but yeah, a, a special thank you um, to 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 you, Sasha, and to you, Leo. Um, you know, for hanging out all day um, and helping with like you know juggling everything. Me, for the most part, I was just you know running the stream and making sure that I joined the uh, the right room. Um, <laughs> but you know, a lot of it was um, Sasha. Um, and Leo doing a lot of stuff behind the scenes, you know, doing quick tech checks with with the speakers to to make sure, um, you know, things are generally working pretty smoothly. And, you know, I'm happy to say that, of course, <laughs> except for um, Leo's bad luck uh, a little bit with with Big Blue Button. <laughs> um, we didn't really have any technical issue, other technical issues this year, um, which is awesome compared to last year. Um, yeah, and Leo, I do look forward to those bug reports too, Big Blue Button. <laughs> you can make sure. I'll, I'll CC you into them, so don't worry about it. <laughs> Please do. Um, yes, so I'll say briefly, I'd very much like to thank our speakers and um, our participants, um, the audience for hanging out with us, watching, and you know, just being a part of this, making EmacsConf 20 as awesome as it turned out as it's turned out to be and um i'm personally very much looking forward to an awesome tomorrow as well um and with that i'll basically speak less and pass it on to sasha and leo to conclude well you're just expecting what? us to have anything well, left to say that. after you <laughs> 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 but no, no. the part of the dlc you're the lead organizer you get to have the last word you have to deal with it. <laughs> Def most definitely yes <laughs> Come on. Um, okay. I mean, if I start I talking know. again, I'll, if I start talking again, I'll What's just up? ramp us right back up. I have so much positive to say about this community. Um, if I'm jumping back in again, it's only to say thank you for uh, running the show, for closing the show, for being in the show. Cheers. Absolutely. I mean, I couldn't say it better myself. Um, yeah. So on that. Great positive note. We, I guess, we will conclude today, and we'll catch you all at uh, nine a.m. tomorrow. <clears throat> and by the way, you can start placing bets to know which color my suit is going to be tomorrow. <laughs> Sounds good. Bye. Alrighty. Bye, guys. Good evening. Bye. Bye.